Jeremy, who's got a cannon, which is cool. That's really cool. Two out of three of the wizards, well, that's not bad. And there's a Utopia and Speed Boots. Not terrible. Um, I could try to go for the gold mine right away, I think. I um, might be doing that. Again, gold mine early would be a good idea. There's Fafner. All right, Jeremy, leave the cannon on Veluska for now. Let's see if we can find anything to do. Fafner and Zyron, interesting. We got a free Ballista, which is cool. We also have Haste, which is cool. Is that a prison? No, it's another warrior tomb. Two warrior tombs, and there's a Pog. We have a Pog, but it's a bad guard. So I'm going to need to figure out how we're going to do the Pog, but I think day one I'm still going to go for the gold mine. Maybe speed boots, maybe gold mine into speed boots, into checking the warrior tombs, and going for the pog somehow. That's probably what we're going to be trying to do. All right, Zyron, another hero, Mel Gibson. Oh yeah, we have a ballista and a cannon. Right, let's leave the ballista here too, because with the ballista we can... Take the Pog. Uh, no heroes with Tic Tacs, though. Ah, oh, there's Luna. That's interesting. Luna is definitely interesting. All right, so actually, Mithramdir, forget about everything that I've said. I forget about everything that I've said. So this is how you play Castle. You roll Luna in the tavern, and you learn my Luna guides on... on uh, on YouTube. That's uh that's that's what you do. Oh CNC. One on one until I get a little yeah. Yeah, you got it. There you go. You're you're all ready to be a pro now. There's a acid box. Probably gonna send Luna for that. Yeah, I think we're probably gonna try to main Luna. Anyway, Veleska is still gonna go. We're still gonna need to figure out how to take that pog. The fact that we have flies is nice. Because uh, flies are gonna be good for. Flies are gonna be good for Luna. Actually, can I actually reach? Uh, yeah, it doesn't look like I reach this this turn, but oh well, I'm still gonna go for it. Sucks one move away. So turn two. Then after that, we try to get. After that, we try to get the. Um, speed boots, I think. Although the speed boots. There's a lot of value that, that there's going to be there. So that's going to be a little bit annoying because the Utopia is 10k value. So I don't know. That's 15k value. I don't know if I want to fight that many whites. Anywho, uh, this is fine. 1.5k. So next turn, we're going to need to be buying Luna. And then the question is, when are we going to be going for the Pog? I think we're gonna need to figure out the warrior tombs. I don't think Luna's gonna go for that box yet. I'll just need to figure out, yeah, I'm not sure if I'm gonna go for that yet. I think I'm probably gonna try to send Veleska that way for the, for the Corsairs, but I'm not 100% sure. All right. 
Yeah, yeah, we have two out of three of the wizards. Well, yes, it's a perfect Luna map. And there's a con, so that's perfect for Luna too. What size? Size one. All right. Uh, okay, I think Luna is going for the cons. Yeah, that's what we're going to do. Luna is going for the cons. Does the cons. And then after that, we do the... Um... Luna does need to level up, though, to advanced fire magic. I need to figure out how I'm going to do that. What we have here. Not too much. Swordsman here. Get the gold mine. Start to chain that back. Hopefully, Veluska can do the cons on, or I mean, the pog on 113 after I get that one angle from the cons. All right, so the question is just going to be how do I do the cons? That is the question. All right, I just need to figure out where to get Luna XP. Churchyard would be nice, but I don't really think I can fight the Acids, or can I? Mm -hmm. Churchyard would be nice, but can I fight the Acids? It'll be tough. I think we're gonna need to try though. Ten, nineteen of them, eh? Well, let's give it a shot. Give it a shot. Really, I don't care so much about the acids. What I do care about is the churchyard. And firewall like this, I guess. Actually, I don't want to go for it. Interesting. But I think if I do a second one, they will. Solid. That worked out well.
Okay, good. That actually worked out pretty much perfectly. That was a difficult fight, guys. That was not an easy fight by any means. That was not an easy fight. All right. Implo, that is Implo. Solid. All right. You have plus morale. God. God. Yeah, and this is the reason why I wanted to do it, because I wanted to um, uh, get Luna Advanced Fire. And we also have, do we have, wait, did we have Angel Feather Arrows on this one? Or was that a different map? Okay, never mind. I guess that was a different map. I thought I had two out of three of the Sniper's Bow. But yeah, this is why I wanted to do this on Luna. Because now Luna can do the pawns without too much trouble actually shit i still kind of need more mana don't i there's a box another acids box acid box acid bot or stormbirds box what the fuck is up with stormbirds acids acids stormbirds uh hold on a minute though three spell power 100 points of damage wait what 100 points of damage bro i actually don't even do the cons Fuck is this? Might go for this box then. Hmm. Twenty forty nine of them, eh? Probably a lot. Bro, I need expert fire. Or more spell power. Well, there's one more spell power. I need two more spell power though. Okay, uh, where's the Artie? Where's that Wizard's Well Artie? Charm of Mana on Brawn. Where's he at? Here. Yeah, I need to try to give that to Luna. Well, anyway, let's see how this goes. We're also going to be doing... I'll do this on Luna so she can get some more XP. All right. Jeremy with a cannon. Try to do that warrior tomb as well. Maybe I'll get spell power in one of the warrior tombs or something. Yeah, but I kind of want to do the pog. I kind of want to do the pog quicker. Right. 
We need to build blacksmiths, so important to continue to build up towards angels. Since we have a pog especially. I want to get that one more spell power. What do I need for another level up? Not much. Try to do another small fight, maybe. Here's... Okay, here we go. Can do that. There's more archers, too, by the way. We're definitely going to get those. And the break is angles. Yo, we heard you like angles, dog. So we put some angles in your angles. You're welcome. Um, not level what I needed. Well, the chest. Now oh, we got it. Solid. Now it's no problem. Okay, next turn. Next turn, we're going to do it. Uh, regular angels. Regular angels break. 200 points of damage. I chain that back. 2049 Ogre Magi. A Diplo break. Yeah, that'd be nice. That would be nice. Oh, wait. We didn't check the thing. Oops. Better check the thing. Definitely check the thing. Where's our ballista ad, by the way? On Zyron. Wait, it's on Zyron? Dude, Zyron. Where's Zyron's far away? And we need to bring that back so that we can do the pog. And I guess we're just going to check this warrior tomb. Also clear the block in this direction. By the way, I should have cleared the block in that direction, too. Yeah, I should clear that block. Right, good thing that we got the additional... I forget something. Yeah, so turn three, or turn four, whoops. Um, turn four is when we're going to get... Mm, Tic-tacs, nice, I'll take it. 
risk-free pog. Nice flail. Also have an interesting box over here. Luna. So after doing the cons, probably try to pour a Luna to replenish her mana and then start doing the boxes with her. Do this box and this box with her for sure. And then after that, we'll figure out that box too. Yeah, we're going to be doing that next turn, not this turn. This next turn is when we actually get the additional angle so that that fight is going to be a lot easier. Let's see if I can get side town here. Pretty far away. Pretty far away. I think. Okay. Set up Jeremy, set up Sorsha there too. Uh, take that town, chain back, uh, get the army back here, get the army to Luna, D Luna does that, then we chain back again, and then to Valeska, and then Valeska does this, and then, damn, we're gonna need to be buying more heroes though, unfortunately, like one more hero at least, I think, is what we'll need, let's see, um, Maybe taking that town right now is not the best idea then. Yeah. I don't really want to buy another hero there. Fuck it. I'll take it later. Don't need to buy one more hero over here anyway. Yeah, and another thing when you're chaining, it's important to figure out like when your chains look a little bit too ambitious and to potentially give up on some things. It always sucks to give up on something, but it's better than completely fucking up your chain. Well, there's two out of three of the sniper's bow. So, I only have three walls. Three walls is slightly problematic. I think I need to bring my archers. I think I need to bring my archers, because I need four walls for this, don't I? One wall, two walls, they move forward. Actually, I know what to do. I think I know what to do. It's not going to be that easy, but I think I know what to do. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven. I think that works. Yeah, I know. I have to use a double wall still. It would have been nice if this was a plus three spell power chest or something at least. Oh, wait. What am I, why am I? Didn't mean to bring these guys. I think like that it should work. Hold on. Too many, too many pikemen. 
need to get rid of one pikeman, I think. Seven. Slot seven. Yeah, slot seven. Okay, I think that should work. The reason I'm doing this... The reason I'm doing this is so these guys would move forward. So that when I put a second wall up, they'll move even closer. And then the when I put the third wall up, they'll actually move to die. Because if I didn't do that, they would still be too far away. If they were still in this position, in this position, in this position, these two, uh, these two 10 stacks would actually not get here um, before, the third, before one of the walls expires. See, now these guys are here, which is perfect. Third wall, boom. Calculated. Calculated it. Okay. So you need to pour a man to replenish mana. I need to get those additional archers later too. That's fine for now. Okay, I guess I'm not going to buy another hero. That's solid, actually. Not having to buy another hero. Well, I'll have to buy Luna, of course, but... No need to buy one more besides that. Speed up Luna. Replenish mana. And then she goes for some of those boxes. Maybe this one into that one. Yeah, so this is definitely not your standard Luna game with uh, with the fact, or I mean, not your standard castle game with the fact that we're actually kind of Luna, Luna cheating here, but. Uh, what do we need? We need, we need, I could go stables actually. Stables sound good. Wait, Mage Guild. Hello. Almost, almost a dumbass here. Yeah, thanks, CNC. I was almost a dumbass. Nah. So now we go... Here. Let's hope we don't get too wrecked here. Wow, that's actually... I don't think I can do much better than that. I, I would be an idiot not to accept that. I would be a dumbass not to accept this. All right, so how are we going to do this? We've got TikToks. Let's use a griffin, I guess. Something like so. And I guess I'll use a swordsman. Ah shit, I needed um I needed the fucking thing. Yeah. The ballista. I don't want to lose the cannon. This is why TikToks are really important for doing pogs, because these motherfuckers have uh, two morale, so 
I always try to do it on um, a hero with tactics plus a ballista. See? You see? You see? You see? Round one morale. We would have been dead without tactics here. See, and this is why we have the ballista. Wow, it even survives? Ballista survived. Interesting. Usually, uh, I would just bring two, like, what I would do is I would bring three pikemen one stacks and two pikemen, or in three pikemen two stacks. I didn't have enough pikemen, so we had to bring a one stack and a, and a one stack here. The... Uh, the reason you do that is so that you block your archers with one stacks and then you give something with higher HP than the one stacks so that the angels aggro on them and not the one stacks. So a two stack obviously has more HP than a one stack and also a swordsman has more HP than a pikeman and a griffin does too. So they will kill the swordsman and the griffin and the two stack first. And they'll also go for the ballista. Yep. Yeah, I have a guide on doing uh, Tier 7 Dwellings and the Portal of Glory I explained there as well. Uh, the good thing about doing the pogs on Valeska is because Valeska, ha a the archers are stronger and she has archery and she has leadership. But still, if it wasn't for tactics, we would have died. If it wasn't for tactics, we would have died there. All right. Um, so thinking about what we're doing next. Probably going to try to build stables. Utopia. So we definitely go for those boxes. I would really like to get to the uh, speed boots. Those would be really nice. So let me send Mel Gibson over here. Also didn't get slow in the mage guild. I don't really need slow that much. Do we have slow, by the way? We don't have slow from any heroes. Bless we have. Should check that shrine, I guess. All right, uh, Valeska, I could do the crypt. I could potentially also do the Naga bank there. Depending on the size of the Naga Bank, that is. The Implo Scroll is definitely pretty nice. Okay. Uh, taking that side town would still be a good idea. Let me probably use the Basilisks to take that, I think. Alright, let's go. Marketplace here. Do this on Mel Gibson. I think I'm going to go ahead and do stables now in the town. Okay, it is a small one. Well, actually, it's not that small. It's at least, yeah, it could be a three or, or t size two or three. So I can't do that right now. It'll be useful to do eventually, though, because I do want to get... I do want to get a um portal of glory before before the end of the week. Should try to do these dwarven treasuries and stuff too. Alright, uh, I do think I'm gonna go stables first. More moves on Luna. Try to roll slow, I guess. Thank you. 
It'd be funny if one of those shrines is actually slow, though. Ah, oh, I forgot to buy the angel. Oops. No, no. It's fine. I don't really need it at the moment. Get it later. The speed boots, though. Mm, actually, yeah, I kind of need the angel for the speed boots. Uh, Mel Gibson, let's go. Maybe it's Jeremy, and then Mel Gibson just grabs it. Boom, 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 something like that. Yeah, speed boots are going to be useful. Nice cannon. Easy. I wonder what the size of the taupe is. Might as well do the Dwarven Treasury, I think. Yep, perfect. Maxi? Oh, balls. Yo, 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 yo. Did not quite sign up for that. This is not what I was expecting. All right, should be fine. Hopefully they don't morale too much. I have plus three morale. Can I morale? Por favor. Yo, 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 yo. This is a little annoying. Just a tad. Alright, hit like this though. Go here. Do that. Okay, nice. Alright, maybe you'll go here, 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 there. Okay, solid. Ay, 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 ay. That's not good. That's alright though. And they didn't morale. All right. All right. Really don't want to lose the angle. Good thing it was the shitty stack that moraled. That was a little scary. Wasn't quite expecting so many of them, but uh, a lot of money. That's really good. All right, now angles on Luna. I'm not gonna bring the cannon on her. Not gonna bring the cannon on her. Um, so I'll go for this box, right? I'll go for this box, and then afterwards I'll probably go for that box. Yeah, I think that's what we're gonna do. This box is probably the worst. Oh, you know what I need to do? I need to get those archers too.
Mercury. Where else do I have Mercury? Okay, I'll need to get Mercury. Let's get that here then. Mercury, I'll also need gems. LeBron James. All right, LeBron James, I think I'll send you this way. You should uh, clear the gremlins later. Maybe next turn I might just leave one angle on Luna. Right. So that we can clear the gremlins like that. And there's Earth, perfect, and this is actually a good box. This could be magic. 41 of them, that's a really good box. <laughs> it is magic. <laughs> it's fire magic, though. <laughs> Not quite what we wanted, but, you know, I'll take it. It's better than, uh, better than, uh, better than... I don't know. Get one more spell power over here and go like this and go for that box next. Yeah, blind is gonna. I mean, uh, there's there's uh, good spells in fire for sure. There's uh. Blind, there's Berserk, Summon Fire is going to be decent. We could probably do the Utopia. Oh, I should check the size of the Utopia, by the way. Yeah, you know what? I'm actually thinking Utopia on Fire Summons, probably. We're going to get two more SP. Yeah, that's probably what we're going to do. We're going to go and uh, hit and run the Utopia with Luna, I think. 115, so next turn I, I take the box and I probably pour him on her and I replenish mana and then I go and do that. Maybe could try to do the library before doing the taupe. So taupe, maybe 117 if I can. I might be able to do the taupe 117. That'd be sweet. Yeah, fire immune creatures Arma. That's also not a bad idea. I mean, Arma's are right if you have enough spell power. But um, I don't really have that much spell power. So, and I also need enough gold to be able to uh, bring the cannon to take the side town like so. Another box that looks kind of interesting. Redwood. Wow, it's a lot of moves on Luna. Size one or two taupe. Well, on one hand, it's not bad that it's not big, but on the other hand, I don't know. On the other hand, I kind of would have liked it to be bigger. Ha, that's what she said. <laughs> Buy one more hero. The fuck is deploy? You have oh diplo deploy. Do you have any heroes with deploy? <laughs> like what? Uh yeah, actually I think uh wait, do I no Adelaide doesn't have diplo? Deploy. Deploy, fire immune. <laughs> It's like, are you, did you forget the word summon? <laughs> did you forget the word summon? And you're like, deploy, deploy fire elementals. Construct additional supply deploys. Well, there's, there's, there's deploy. There's somebody with deploy. Yeah, we could deploy, we could deploy, uh, the Ifrit. Right, um.
Gotcha. I gotcha. Uh, 37 archers only. Hmm. Only 37 of them, eh? Monastery. Better grab the monks too, just in case. All right, uh, I really need to figure out more money. I'm gonna need to try to do... I need to pour them on Luna, and I need to figure out the Naga Bank. So let's go ahead and try this. I need the one more spell power. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I can't do that box. I can't do the box. Bro. That sucks, actually. Well, I, d I do need to pour them on Luna this turn, but how, though? Hold on a minute. Churchyard, I guess? Fuck. Expert fire, 7 SP. What do I summon? 24. Not much. Hmm. Okay, maybe Taupe 121 then. Maybe I do the Taupe 121, but I need to set up for the Naga Bank as well, because next turn, probably need to do the Dwarven Church. Okay, uh, yeah, if I can get the library next turn, library and replenish my mana, but then how do I pour a mana? Yeah, I really need to figure it out. Do this. I really, it really sucks that I can't get through over here. I was really hoping that this wouldn't happen. I was really hoping that there was a way through to this box. I was hoping to do the box and then pour them out over here on the trogs and then give the army here and these guys do the Naga Bank there. But that didn't work out for us. Anyway, I uh, have to do this. And I guess I'll have to do the churchyard. Doesn't look like there's two ways about that. Oh shit. Messed that up a little bit. Messed up the positioning, but oh. It's fine. Nice. Thank you for morale. I'll be replenishing Luna's mana anyway, so it's fine. Expert Earth plus Defense. Armor of Wonder. That's actually nice. Additional spell power and additional knowledge. And so I think next turn... I'll be trying to pour them on, and I'll be trying to do that library. And then replenish my mana with that. But I also need to do the Dwarven Treasury. Pour them on there, and then do that, and then pour them on again. But then can I build angles? I really need to. Pour them on on these guys. 
1.3k and then pour them out on these and then on gotta think about this how many moves is that Eight hundred, nine hundred thousand, one, two, three, four, one point four K should be enough. Because we are level oh, we're not even level ten. What am I talking about? Okay, never mind. We're not level ten. Alright, we're not level ten. So in that case it doesn't matter. All right, uh, but I really want to get the Naga Bank. That's going to be necessary for next turn for sure with Valeska, I think. Okay. Something like that, I think. Right, I think Veluska can reach the Naga Bank like that, so that should be enough to get the thing that I need. Cannon, I don't really need the cannon. You can go here. Zyron, you can chill here, and I can't really bring that hero out, can I? Still need more, more gold and more mercury, by the way. Mm, I have to get rid of somebody. I have to get rid of... Okay, I guess I'll get rid of Mel Gibson then. Mm. Yeah. Or maybe Jerome. You can collect some gold. Oh, not you. You. Okay, good stuff over here. Got a tavern here. Right. He has walked in. Yeah, yeah. I mean, like, like I said, it takes practice. You just really need to. You just really need to uh, get good at prioritizing. You gotta get good at the things like you. You, you gotta, uh, you know, split your priorities into. What's the most important? Oh, we have another Utopia. That's nice. Uh, what's the most important? And then the things that are like secondary or tertiary, kind of like nice to haves, you know? And, uh, and understand that it's like, you know, set up your stuff so that you can, uh, you know, try to do the most important stuff. And then as you can do the rest of the stuff, you know, just kind of do them as you can do them, you know? Like, and, and if, you, if you happen to give up on something, you know, make that not the important stuff that you give up on. All right, well, we have enough gems, just need a little bit more mercury. And we need to do that in the Ga Bank. I'd love to give you the playlist, but I, uh, it's just a YouTube, um, like it would be a it's a YouTube generated playlist based on my you know music that I listen to, so it would be different for you, fortunately. All right, here's Mercury. Which song? This song or the previous one? The previous one was this. And that, and the next one was this.
No problem. <laughs> All right, so we're we'll replenish Luna's mana and try to do the Utopia on Luna A. Also, let's try to do this now. Ah, uh, yeah, it was, it's a new game. It's a new game. The opponent was gone, so. Oh, what? Hi, you bitch. Well, good thing that the Dwarven Treasury is big. Hoping these assholes don't morale. If I can morale, that's nice. Solid. Hmm. Earth Mujik on Zyron. Not bad. All right, so we're almost, we almost have enough money. Still gonna do that. Have enough mercury. Shield would be nice to do before the Utopia, actually. The guard is Nyx. I'm gonna try to do that. Try to do the shield before the Utopia. Also need to set up another hero. Well, whatever. Anybody can go there. Could do that. Size three, not bad. Or I mean size two, three Nagas, I mean. New morale? Be nice. Hmm. Like I'm taking a hit, fortunately. Where's the morale's at? Fine, not that bad. Okay, now we can build the angles. So, what are we gonna do next? Uh, get the pog there. Veluska goes back down. Luna does the taupe. Okay, I try to do the.
try to do the Topia aim. Boom, boom, boom. Chain that back. Luna. Luna then is going to do the Tope. 7 SP. Summons 28. 28 is not that much, but if I can get that shield, that'd be nice. How many moves is it to get there? Kind of a lot. Should be able to get it though, I think. Hopefully. Do I have another? No, Zyron doesn't have any moves, but I'm gonna get one more hero and I should be fine though. Boom, 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 and then Luna does that. All right, should be fine. Don't think I need to set up anything else. So see, and again, uh, yeah, I'm thinking like uh, Mithrandir right now. Again, I'm thinking about what I'm doing next turn, right? And I'm doing the Utopia on Luna next turn, basically. And what's going to happen is we're going to do the Utopia on summons, leave one dragon alive, and uh, then finish it on a hero with army. So that way we lose no army. And then Luna is going to replenish her mana again. And uh, maybe even go for that Utopia. So I might actually buy... Wait, uh, did I buy a Marketplace? Ah, shit, I should have bought a Tavern. Oh, well, there's a well here. Okay, never mind. There's a well here. So I might actually buy Luna back here and through the well do that Utopia with her next. I might be doing that. How many Angels do we have? We're only going to have six. Only going to have six Archangels. If we get Archangels, it's not that amazing. And uh, yeah, so I'm thinking, uh, okay, and before the Utopia, I also want to do the shield, right? So again, I'm positioning these heroes in a way I, I'll need to get the angel from here. Well, that's actually not that necessary, but I'll need to um, try to get the shield because 28 summons, 28 fire elementals is not that much, so I need uh, better stats for them. So, so yeah, and that's, uh, that's why I'm trying to think. It would be good to do the library at some point too, though. Can I do the library before doing the Utopia is the question. Let me think about... Wait, I, I, keep, I keep talking about the library. I'm not level 10 yet. I'll have to do it later if I do it later. Yeah, so I think that and then replenish my mana in the well and position for that Utopia is what we're going to do. Anyway, let's go. Can I actually have a chain go all the way there too? Maybe, maybe on Veleska. Because I kind of want to chain the Arties to Luna so that she can replenish. She'll, there, there's probably going to be better Arties there. There's probably going to be better Arties, but this is more important. Anyway. Okay, so we want to try to get that shield, eh? Damn. Doesn't look like I can get it, actually. 600. Fuck. Not enough moves. 
You have to do that Utopia without the shield. That sucks. Thanks for the follow, Mithrandir. Yeah. So you see uh, right here, for example, just a couple of moves, but if I do that, I'm not going to be able to chain back and I'm not going to be able to uh, do the Utopia this turn, which I really want to do. So I'm actually giving up on picking up that shield, which is the entire reason I went here, but needed another hero there to actually be able to get it. That's unfortunate. Let's hope we don't get wrecked in the Utopia because of that. Let's hope we don't get wrecked in the Utopia. And then we will need one more hero, so I'll probably get a marketplace here too. So I can trade for one more hero. Utopia is not big, which is good. I think I should be okay. Four summons should be able to do a decent amount of damage. It is a size two. Um, oh, by the way, we can also use Implo. Probably not gonna do Implo actually. Probably just gonna go straight for summons. Now. Hmm. Actually, it's not going very well. Barely doing any damage here. Now. Yeah, uh, this actually didn't go very well. I'm trying to think if I can actually finish this on a side hero now. Probably next turn. Next turn with the um, armor and stuff. Kill what? One more. One more dragon, I guess. I only killed, what, two greens, one black, and one gold, I guess? Zero, really? Fuck. Okay, then. Okay. 
I was a bit greedy, could have actually gotten wrecked, but whatever. Well, we did weaken it a little bit. Barely. Um, Syrah could implo once. Syrah could implo once. If I do it on Syrah. Hmm. If I pour him on Syrah. Yeah, now I can get the shield indeed. Indeed I can. Yeah, with the shield it would have been way better. I think with the shield I would have been able to do it, but it's fine. It's not that bad. Still gonna be doing the other Utopia um, next turn. Yeah, I will be getting the shield now. And somebody else, probably Syra, is going to do the Utopia. She can only implow once, though, which is a little bit annoying. Speed. Implo once with only three spell power. Still something though. Or maybe Valeska is better. She has better battle stats. I don't know, we'll see. I'll think about it. And I need some more Mercury too. And I need to trade. And I need to trade. Hopefully we'll be able to do two Utopias next turn. Get the shield for sure. Okay, for sure I'm gonna need a hero over here. Hey, Red Ace. I've probably taken that box too, actually. I do that. Take that on Caitlyn, maybe that's additional meat. No, 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 I want the shield. All right. And then Caitlyn is gonna bring the army back to Luna, like so, I think. Braun will grab the army, grab that box, grab that, give the army here. 
we grab that poor man Syrah. Syrah goes through that, finishes that Utopia with that dumbass. I'll need another hero. I that's the whole reason I wanted I wanted to chain this stuff back. Yeah, that's why I needed to trade with Braun. Okay. Dumbass. Uh we'll need to buy one more hero then. A lot of heroes that I have to buy. That's a lot of heroes that I have to buy. Hey, Para. Right, let's go. Sims completed. Tell the guy that I can add a sim turn if he wants. Now I can get rid of Jeremy at least. No need. At them. Uh, going on vacation. I'll be going on vacation. Buy one more hero. Okay. Let's go. No, we didn't do it. Nice. That's perfect, actually. That is an awesome box. Very awesome. Exactly what I needed. That's real big help for the Utopia. Odd. 
Luckily, the red didn't go for the angels, which is great. Nice. Good. Don't go for the angles. Perfect. Probably losing an angle here, though, unfortunately. Yeah. Oh, well, not that bad. Solid. That's pretty solid. Well, Tome Tom of Fire is not, but Tome of Earth is. Tome of Earth definitely is. I mean, could have been way, way worse, so. I'd say it's close to about the best we could have gotten. Diplo game? Yeah. Maybe. Could Diplo those a freak, maybe, with Syrah. Would she get advanced Diplo? Yeah. Yeah, like, we didn't get stats, which is the only thing that sucked there, but... But now I can use shit summons, and I also have... Town portal. Should summons are going to be way better than fire summons. Yeah. Intelligence, probably take intelligence. Nice three. Hmm. A little bit afraid of this, actually. I think I'm going to try to do it. Uh... Without. Um... Without the angles on me. That nah, should be fine, I think. Yeah, <sighs> you had to summon here. Come on, man. Oh, if I had 150 mana, it would be easier? Oh, no shit. Holy shit. Is that how this works? When you have more mana, that this is easier? You don't say, guys. You don't say. The positioning of the elementals kind of screwed us, actually. Yeah. 
can't do anymore. But that's okay. Because we're just gonna wizards well and do that, or I mean magic well and do that again. On portal, I guess. Finally. Ah, 5 HP, really? Oh, shit. Holy fuck, that was greedy. <laughs> that was dumb. Couldn't have done that. Well, I could have shielded or something. I guess I'll buy her back here to replenish mana. So that I can finish with the arties. Hmm, Brissa, Brissa can finish with Implo. Yeah, sounds like a good idea. Okay, no angles lost. No stats. No stats. That really sucks, actually. I mean, we got full control, but no stats. E99 Medusas. Full control, but no stats is kind of lame. Looks like I'm gonna have to do the library. Uh, we need some additional mercury.
out of lifeblood. Five arcane goals is all we got, eh? Probably try to do... Should probably try to do the black market. Maybe I'll get something here. Helm of Chaos. The only thing. Nothing for spell power. Did I see another black market? Should probably check that one too. I care more about spell power than mana. I have a decent amount of mana, 108, but I really need more spell power. In TS could DD, I guess, or TP or something. She could TP too. Okay. Get that. Yeah, okay. I don't know what to do. Grab the army, chain it there. I'll DD with NTS to here so I can grab that, give the army back to Caitlyn. Caitlyn TPs, then Luna TPs. Might do the library with Luna. Um,. Should also clear that, do the black tower. Might try to... How much mana do, do visions cost? It's two, right? Uh, might try to diplo those guys for some kind of an armor bomb later. Yeah. So all in all, this is not looking great. But hey. It's not looking horrible either. The Utopias could have been a lot better. Basically, the Earth Tome is the only useful thing we got. I don't even care about the Spellbinders Hat out of one, two, three, four relics. We only got one good one, really. Spellbinders Hat is good, too. Uh, oh, yeah, out of five relics, actually. Out of five, we really only got one good one. Spellbinders Hat is good, but um, it, it's sort of useless, except for DD. DD is really the only thing from the Spellbinders hat that we care about. And uh, I would have much rather had a teapot, for example. That would have been way better. Teapot, SOJ, something. Anyway, that's the way it goes sometimes. We'll see what happens here. We'll have a lot of moves on Luna, but I don't think we're breaking next turn. We may not necessarily break next turn because I'm trying to do the library next turn as well. I think the library is going to be necessary for additional money. I mean, money. I mean, how um, much money am I going to need for upgrading? I might actually even get Artie Merchants. I'll think about that. Anyway, let's go. I think that's it for now. All right, well, let's see how this is going to go. I 
I know what I could have done. I could have actually gotten that spell power thing. Or the hat. No. Mm. Would have been more mana. That's fine. Let's get it 10k though. Okay, it's kind of a lot. Give it a shot like this. Mm. <laughs> nice duplicate spellbinders hat. Well, Dragon Bone Greaves. Something, I guess. Speed gloves. Yeah, I have to go for the library. Yeah, getting the additional spell power would have definitely been nice. Nah, no money for the fuck you thing. Oh, uh, didn't have that on. Whatever. Okay then. Well, that's not gonna be too bad. I have to clear those Ogre Magi too. Jeremy's back.
Which man on now 188 with 11 spell power. All right, well, it's not 12 spell power, actually. I do want to have the speed uh, gloves on, though, I think. Do that on Syra. Maybe she can get her expert Diplo like that. Maybe Diplo some shit. Mm hmm there it is. Mm hmm That Mercury. Counter-Strike, fuck yeah! Well, there's five AAs. Five AAs and Luna with Expert Earth and stuff. 3k moves. <laughs> Diplo the Angels, that would be sweet. <laughs> I would need a lot to do that though. 50 mana on Syra A. Eh? Tower Center, by the way. Was the opponent Tower? Yeah, the opponent was Tower, I think. Wait, okay, that's fine. All right. Could have actually built arty merchants there too, I think. But I don't think I'm going to do that. Let's go. 188, 188 with 12 SP. And decent, decent implo, decent summons, decent stats. It's not too bad. Could also use interference if anything. Now nah, let's go. All right. Okay, stats don't look too scary. That's good. Air magic, fire magic, archery.
couple of pickets we still got around here. But I do believe we just move out. there's an archangel stack that they have two four of them dicks smiles It'll be interesting to berserk all of these guys. Don't know if that's going to make sense, though, but maybe. What's my morales, by the way? Water Magic. Um, yeah, let's go Water Magic. I don't think I really need Ballistics. Archangels are pretty much going to guarantee us the first move anyway. I go for the Arch Devil's Prison. Is a question. Why not? Might be a good hero. Sound that bad? This is a level 20, it looks like. Fuck you and your morales.
Probably shouldn't have used that Berserk. Level 30 piece of shit, got it. Does have scouting and stuff. Oh yeah, I'm at level 30. Uh, could I do that Utopia on only, only the Archangels? Probably not. Let's say DD was Luna. Oh, actually, yeah, I could DD was Luna. Yeah, let's do that. the hero here is going to be better like this is the dd Taxes are right on Luna, especially. Syra has Diplo, Zyron has Scholar. I guess I'll get rid of Briss or whatever. Yes, I would have better morale if I used castle meat with the angles. All right, nice. That is a hero with expert earth, level 30. Solid. Expert earth, expert scholar too. Where's the center town is the question now. Learn 20 mana. That's the center town. Okay, that's the opponent. All right. Well, we just attack him on um, on this going then. Sounds better than attacking him on. What's his face? Anti-magic on the arc angles probably is what we need to do. Yeah, that's probably it.
cannon helps too. And close scroll. Fire tome, earth tome. Fire summons, air summons, magic mirror. I don't think I need any of that. We'll have the ambassador's sash on us though. That's something like this. And the cannon. Yeah, seems reasonable. Seems reasonable, I think. And then Luna. And 86 mana. As an angle. As some other stuff. I think he's probably wrecked. Should be pretty wrecked, I think. This could be, um... This could be meat, so... Let me try to do it. Genies will be cool. Nope. So we better keep all of these arties in case he actually somehow we have to retreat or something so that none of those arties are on Luna or on anyone else here. Should have uh, left some more stuff on Luna, by the way. But, oh well. Guess I'm a trade, max trade, in case I have to surrender. Uh, I didn't have anybody who could reach him to arm a bomb. Krellian has no spellbook, so. Actually, Krellian is not bad for a final fight, though. Was expert interference, but no spellbook. So that's annoying. Anyway, let's go. 42 genies. <laughs> he fucked up on one stacks. <laughs> Funny. He fucked up on the genie one stacks. Alright, um... Are we going to Implo or are we going to Anti-Magic? It doesn't have much mana. So. I can Implo the Genies, I guess. I have good stats. Plus two morale is nice. So it's either implode genies or go for anti magic. Oh, I have ballistics too, nice. Oh, since I have ballistics, okay, I can just implode. It doesn't matter if he slows me next turn. Better implode, that way he can't anti magic either, so. 24 like that. One point seven K. A little bit overkill, I guess. Ducks or genies? Well, if I do genies, they can't cast. If I do ducks, he can't really do damage. 28 ducks do more damage than 42 genies. I think.
Hello, Bear. Um, thanks for watching the YouTube. I'm glad that you're here watching Twitch. He actually, okay, that, that haste doesn't really do much for him. Let's see, though. I can res and stuff, too, so. Yeah, that's probably true. His haste actually, funnily, doesn't help him. Is, uh, with, with that ballistics. Okay, now he's gonna hit... Ooh, nice morale. Nice morale. Hey, why do you... Why didn't you attack the angle, dumbass? Cannon? Well, kill the angle, I guess. And we just implode the genies. No problem. Looks like GG. Gigi. Actually, again. And that's how it's done. And that is how it's done. That was, uh, that was a pretty good game. The Utopias could have been better, but... See, and this is why it's frustrating to play against Castle. The dude was in the center for a while. Probably since, like, 1-2-1. And we just casually break one, two, three, and just wreck him. Although he could have opened that prison. If he opened that prison, I wouldn't have, uh, it wouldn't, wouldn't have been as easy for us. Yeah, doesn't have much how he didn't even have Earth. Didn't even have Earth. Pretty solid army, but no Earth. I guess he like just reached the center or close to it. Yeah. I guess he built Mage Guild. Okay, yeah, didn't even have a tap. Wait, didn't build Mage Guild? What? He built a Lookout Tower? That's weird. Well, I guess he had full mana. I guess he didn't have gold. Yeah, okay, he didn't have gold for a tavern. Lots of genies, though. Not a bad, uh, not too bad of a map for him. But, uh, couldn't get anybody with Earth, apparently. Didn't he start Solmir? Did he lose Solmir? Did he dismiss him? Looks like center wasn't all that amazing either. He did have a couple of utopias in his biome. I wonder if they were any good. But I don't know if uh, going for utopias would have made sense for him. Since he, it doesn't look like he has giants, so he couldn't have really gone titans. Yeah, only two. I mean, not bad utopias, but they're pretty small, so... Yeah, it wouldn't have really made sense for him to do that. I mean, what was this Utopia, I wonder? Size one. So actually, like, all Utopias are kind of meh. 